What is up guys, this is Incredibly Average Joe bringing you another Madden 20 video. Before we get started, if you're new to the channel and you're enjoying the content, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and the little bell icon there so you can know whenever I put out my latest videos. At the time of this recording, it's a few hours until the sweepstakes ends and at that point I will know who the winner is. Uh, I'm going to announce that during the Friday video so y'all make sure you tune in for that one. Uh, besides that, uh, before we get into some house rules here, I'm going to show you all my lineup. I not, not a whole lot of changes. I did complete the uh, what, Gridiron Nightmare, and I picked up A.J. Green. Um, I, I didn't really love the four choices. A.J. Green, he's fine. I'm, I'm probably not going to use him a lot. Uh, he'll be my third string. Actually, you know what I can do is I can get rid of Christian Kirk here. I don't even remember why I had him on my team. Uh, we'll put Michael Thomas as the fourth here. Anyway, uh, yeah, so we, we picked up A.J. Green as our third receiver. Probably won't use him very much, but nonetheless, he is there. We'll be able to trade him into a set or something later on, maybe, if we want. Also, before we get into the gameplay, I was going to go ahead and open a pack. As you can see, I have almost 9,000 bats up there. I'm just going to buy one of these 85 to 88 overall most feared players, just to use up my bats. I know that they'll probably convert over to training or whatever, but uh, I figure, what the heck, we'll just open a pack. All right, let's see who we get. Come on, give me an 88. Give me an 88. And 88, Casey Hayward Jr. Honestly, I really needed a cornerback. So this is a really, really good pull for me. I really like this. Uh, I haven't really looked into this card very much. Let's see. Not great speed. Uh, let's see. Decent agility. Uh, obviously, he's not going to compare to Jalen Ramsey here. Let's let's look at him compared to Gilmore. All right, so he's pretty more. He's pretty comparable to Gilmore. A little bit lower in most of the stats, but my third string was uh, Lattimore, and pretty much Lattimore's got him in speed and a little bit in jumping. But in general coverage, uh, Hayward's going to be the top one. So I'm going to go slot him into my starting lineup, and then we'll get right into some house rules gameplay because I have hardly done any. All right, guys. So I thought it would just be a little fun just to do some of the house rules here, even though I'm, I'm almost certainly not going to get to 100 wins unless I'm just flying through them here or something. I'm not really going to dedicate a whole lot of time to it uh, but i know i'm sure a lot of you have oh y'all it's actually been a little bit since i've played a real player so this might be a little rough so i think i've played like maybe two games in uh house rules so not quite used to it yet for sure and everyone else is probably around 70 wins or so if they're going for that full 100 get it gilmore how did he not pick that that was really odd anyway so you guys let me know how you're doing with these house rules if you're really trying to get that 100 i mean it's a lot of wins, but you get a really good card. I would personally go for Denzel Ward if I was playing. I'm not. Ah, oh, well. Yeah, so I would take Denzel Ward if I was going for the 100 wins. But because I'm not, I probably won't be getting that card unless I get lucky on a pull somewhere. So of all the new most feared cards, we've had a lot of them. And I'll, I'll do some more in my pack review on uh, or my card review on Friday so we can discuss a little more. Um, which one has been y'all's favorite, I guess, of the cards? Because... I really only got the first part of Most Feared done. I was gone for a good part of the second, so I didn't get the head start that I did on the first and pick that, pick that. He's just trying to Randy Moss. Come on. There we go. Yeah, so I mostly just got the first part done, not a lot of the second. So, come on. Get up. Oh, I thought he was going to break that one. My point being is that I didn't get to try out a lot of cards, like the Peyton Manning, the Denzel Ward, of course, the Dominican Sue, all those guys. So if there's one of those from series, not series two, from the, from the part two of Most Feared, then let me know. Um, I'm really curious about that. Also, just a reminder, everyone, uh, series three is on Friday. So if you're saving up your series two trophies, they are going to go away. So don't be holding on to those. Nice catch, Kittle. I said don't be holding on to those, but if you can't hold on to them, they're just going to get cut in half. So if you've got 500, you'll have 250 after or uh, during Friday, whenever that changes over, um, and they'll be converted to Series Three trophies. So that'll give you a little bit of a head start on whatever the the player is that comes out for you know you can get the Nat for whatever it is 1,100 trophies, or the full card for a little over 2,000. Um, so if that's what you want to do, then go for that. Uh, but just be aware. Dang it, that was not a very good throw. Just be aware that uh, they are going to be cut in half. Personally, I am about uh, close to 800 trophies. I think I'm 740. Maybe maybe I'm closer to 700. I don't remember. But I'm probably just going to trade him in for some touchdown packs and quick sell those for some coins so I can get ready for Series 3. Um, oh, what a hit. I haven't decided on that yet, but uh, I'll probably just be taking the coins because I'm a wuss and that's what I do. I'm probably completely ruining the meta for this house rules, aren't I? It's probably supposed to be chunking it deep. And I'm just 
running like an idiot, like it's a normal game. Here he goes. Yeah, see, he's just trying to win right now. Swat it. There you go, Gilmore. He's got that X factor. You're not going to throw it on him. All right, well, let's try and throw a touchdown here to Holt. He'll probably pick it, but whatever. I know I have more yards than him, so I know that gets me the win. Whenever that is, I don't, I don't, there's the touchdown. That's what we wanted. There we go. There's a win. All right, let's get into one more. All right, so we're going to do one more. Um, I'm going to level with you guys. I just got the new Call of Duty, and I really want to go play that a little bit. So there's a good, go, go, Kittle. Go, Kittle. Oh, I thought that was going to be over quick. Um, anyway, I got the new Call of Duty, and I do want to go play that some. I'm excited about it. Y'all let me know down in the comments if y'all, uh, if y'all got that and if you're going to be playing it some, taking away from some of your Madden time, but that's okay. You can spread it around, play some different games. I'm not going to be making any videos on Call of Duty. I'm still going to be sticking with Madden. Uh, but if, if anyone wants to talk to me about it, uh, I will be playing it some. Also, I'm going to try a little something. Just curious here. If you are still watching the video at this point, first of all, thank you. Second of all, why don't you comment peanut butter down in the comments below? Really curious to see who's still watching uh, this far. I don't know what minute marker it'll be in the video, but I'm curious to see who will still be watching and uh, which one of you guys really watched the videos all the way through. Not that you have to, of course. I'm just sort of curious. And stopped him. All right. <laughs> Very close. So if you have missed some of my previous videos where I talked about these new most feared guys that I have, I've actually, I've really been liking all of them. Uh, I really like Cam Newton. I know he's kind of not a super popular pick, but I like him a lot. He just plays well for me. Uh, Earl Thomas has been doing a really solid job as my free safety, despite being super short. And uh, of course, Ray Lewis is solid and Lockett's been a beast in the return game, as well as a pretty solid receiver. So come on, get the tackle. Good Lord. He almost broke out of that. All right, we're going to try and hit something big, but he's bringing a lot of pressure, so not going to happen. Dang it. I don't want know why I keep doing uh, play action because he's just completely destroying me on that. He's just running another stretch, and he's going to get the touchdown and the game. All right, guys. Well, I am going to end it there. Uh, I might try and go for the, the uniforms uh, just for fun, but I'm certainly not going to be going for 100 wins. You guys let me know how many wins you have, whether you're trying to get to 100 or not and which player you are going to be taking if you do get to the 100. So guys, I hope you enjoyed that video. Thank you all so much. Like I said, we're growing. We're over 150 subscribers now. Thank you guys so much for all the support. It really means a lot. Uh, I know a lot of you are watching the videos and stuff, and I really appreciate that very, very much. Every view, every subscriber, it all really means a lot to me. So thank you guys so much. I hope you guys keep tuning in, enjoying the uh, last and the most feared. We're gonna be having those guys grow and get oversized soon so be sure to play some of that that'll be fun and don't forget that we have series 30 coming up on friday again your trophies are going to be cut in half if you don't use them so either use them or just be aware that they're going to be cut in half and converted to series 3 trophies all right guys i will see you in the next one and remember stay average